Hey guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and this video is a little unexpected. I really wasn't planning on making it, but I've just had so many requests that I thought, why not? Plus, all my old videos about this are outdated, and they're not dedicated just to the iPhone 3G. So here it is. This video will show you guys how to jailbreak and unlock your iPhone 3G on firmware 4.2.1 for T-Mobile or any other SIM card around the world. And yes, this will really work on any SIM card around the world. Here's just some examples, T-Mobile, h 2 Simple Mobile, Red Pocket, the Go phone for AT&T. So if you travel internationally, you don't have to worry about having no service. This will work on any GSM SIM card. Now, as I already said, my old video is outdated and it uses an old version of Red Snow. It's just not dedicated just to the 3G. So I just want to make this video as clear as possible to new 3G unlockers. And I want to make a dedicated video just to the 3G. Now to answer some questions, no, this will not delete any data, but some of you guys might mess up and tend temporarily break your 3G. So if that happens, you want to make sure to click on this annotation right here. It'll take you to my 3G 4.2.1 restore video and make sure if you're worried about that, that you back up in iTunes any data you might have. So just in case you do have to restore your iPhone. Yes, this will work with any iPhone 3G. There's no serial code restrictions and this will work with an 8 gigabyte model as well. And of course, this does include the 4.2.1 untethered jailbreak. And no, you guys do not need to unlock as well as jailbreak. You could just jailbreak. I'll show you guys how to do that when we're in red snow now before we begin I just want you guys to go into settings general about and I want you to make sure your iPhone is running 4.2.1 if it's on 4.1 this will work you just need to use the 4.1 firmware but I would recommend 4.2.1 to make things easier and your baseband should be 5.15.04 if it's 5.13.04 or lower like mine you guys can unlock it by just jailbreaking going into Cydia and installing Ultra Snow as easy as that for everybody else you're gonna have the 5.15.04 baseband or 5.14.02 and that's perfectly fine. We're just going to be using Red Snow to update our baseband to 6.15.00, which is an unlockable baseband. Now there is one little side effect of this unlock, and since it's built for an iPad, the iPad baseband we're going to be installing doesn't support GPS. So for most people, your GPS will stop working on your iPhone 3G, and until the dev team can find a fix, you'll have to learn to live with it. It's not a big problem, guys, but just warning you, your GPS might stop working. All right, and let's head over to our computer. Now you guys will need to download two things and that's Red Snow 0.9.6 Beta 6. And the reason we're using an older version of Red Snow is because this is the most reliable version. If even this version doesn't work, I will post links to other versions of Red Snow, but 0.9.6 Beta 6 is well known for working on the iPhone 3G especially. And the new versions, they tend to crash. So if you use a newer version of Red Snow, you might break your 3G and end up having to restore it. But okay, now you guys will also need your iPhone 3G 4.2.1 official firmware. And okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Now on a Windows computer, you want to right click on Red Snow and run as administrator. Click yes and make sure your iPhone 3G is plugged in and you want to make sure to take out any SIM cards that might be inside. Sometimes they do interfere with the unlock, uh, usually not, but it is good to be safe. And okay, so let's go ahead and browse for our 4.2.1 official firmware. It's going to process it for a moment and we're going to click next. It's going to prepare the jailbreak data real quick. And here at the options menu, you want to make sure install Cydia and install iPad baseband is checked. Yes, we're sure we want to do this. And any other options you might want, you can check them. But that's it for me, so we're just going to go ahead and click next. And power off your iPhone. And let's move this aside. Now as soon as we click next, you want to make sure to hold the power button for 3, 2, 1. Together with the home button for 10, 9, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let go of the power button and keep holding the home button. You guys can let go as soon as this pops up. And this will take about 10 to 15 minutes, guys, in order to download the iPad baseband files and flash your baseband and of course jailbreak. But once that's done, I'll be right back. Make sure not to interrupt the jailbreak. Now, while this is jailbreaking and unlocking, I just want to let you guys know that if you have any kind of errors during the Red Snow jailbreak, make sure to read the guide down below. There will be a link to my video that'll show you guys how to fix Red Snow in case you guys have any kind of errors. All right, and after your iPhone has finished jailbreaking, it will reboot. So now we're ready to go into Cydia. 
and install ultra snow now don't forget this is a 3g so Cydia loads basically forever and once it's done I'll be right back and once Cydia has finished loading we're gonna go into search and we're gonna search for ultra snow now you're gonna want to install that and once this is done you're gonna click ok respring and make sure to power off your iPhone and alright so once your iPhone is off we're gonna go ahead and insert the T-Mobile or whichever other SIM card you have into our iPhone. I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. And into the phone. And you're gonna power on. Now, yeah, this is a 3G, so it does take a while. And once it's powered on, I'll be right back. And there you have it, my iPhone 3G is now running on T-Mobile. As you can see right there, T-Mobile service. And whichever carrier you might have, after it reboots, give it about five minutes to find service. But in the end, you guys will be unlocked on your iPhone 3G, jailbroken on 4.2.1. All right, guys, I appreciate you watching, and I'd appreciate it even more if you rated this video. It does help. Of course, if you have any comments or questions, leave them down below. I will try to get to those, and subscribe for more great videos. Now, enjoy your unlock and jailbreak, guys. Peace.